Oh, what is going on, guys? It is your boy Bristol Bolt here, and today, guys, going to be bringing you the total price to complete the League Un um, League SBC, guys. And uh, we're going to go through all the teams, going to look at the price of all the teams, look at the golds, the silvers, the bronzes that are required, and then we're going to look at the discard. Uh, pack values right at the end to take that away from the price to complete the SBC to see generally worst case scenario the amount of coins it is going to cost you after packs but as always guys make sure you like and subscribe for more content um, now um, we're going to be using footbin obviously footbin's a great um, is a great little uh, site where you can look at the prices uh, to complete these SBCs and what we've gone we've gone and got all of the teams up and I'm going to talk you through each of the teams um, and uh, things to look out for so we, we uh, begin with the Amiens SBC now um, these golds here aren't going to be costing you too much they're going to be uh, quite good um, the centre back will cost you a little bit more because it's the only um, the, the, well there's a lack of centre backs especially for Amiens uh, so the centre back the right back um, is going to set you back and that it's going to be a common theme guys the left mid the right mid the, the left mid, the right mid, the right back and the left back are always going to set you back a few more coins. So you might want to kind of bid on these players or, or look to snipe them at, you know, at certain points of the year when a lot of these packs are being opened. Um, but at, at this point, it's probably a better time to do it, uh, to do the SBC rather than later on when these cards are continue to be used up. So we're going to move on to uh, Angers, uh, mainly gold team. Um, you're going to have to put a goalkeeper in at right back, the left back, left wing and right mid again being fairly uh, expensive. But overall this team's coming in uh, and goes at around 15k. So not too bad at all. Move on to the next one, AS Monaco around 12k. Fairly standard, all 11 goal players. And for it, it, it's not really a, ha um, a half bad pack, a goal players pack. Um, so you're probably going to spend after, pack, uh, after the pack reward around 6k. Uh, on this SBC total, so we're going to continue on, and we have Saint Etienne, and again, four gold team, Ruffier and goal is going to set you back around two thousand coins. But for the majority of all these players around this card, and one of the cheaper teams actually in Ligue 1. We move on to Dijon, and again, uh, fair few golds, but you look at that right back and left back, and this centre back probably going to be fairly expensive. But again, the golds as you see, uh, fairly cheap. 9,000 coins, not too bad at all. Uh, we have EA Gwingam, and uh, again, generally uh, from from uh, from the past, it has been quite an expensive SBC, but it's not too bad just this year as the silvers aren't going for too much. The centre backs definitely will be the most expensive ones here, but with the golds along the wings and then uh, into the midfield and the fence, not going to be too expensive at around 14,000 coins. We next have Nantes, and this is going to begin to get a little bit more expensive. Some of these prices probably haven't updated too much yet, but I would expect these to be a little bit higher. Um, and this team probably will be around 12 or 13k, even though it says 9.5k right here. But yeah, be careful of the silvers in the team. We move on to Bordeaux, and again, mainly gold teams, so you're not going to have very many issues at all completing this SBC. And you should be doing it very cheap. Um, you might even get it cheaper than the 8.5k indicated on screen. Uh, move on to the to Lille and uh, not the cheapest team to say the least. Again, you're looking at the left back, right back, right back, and the left mid setting you back 4k and uh, about 2k for each of the full backs. So you want to be trying to snipe them. Move on to Montpellier and um, not not bad of a team actually. I've completed it myself because the pack is quite decent actually. You receive a rare mixed players pack, and uh, again, it's just the silvers that are going to set you back um, for the centre backs. Um, but all in all, um, not too bad to complete. Move on to the next one, which is Nimes, and this one is going to get fairly expensive. So you want to complete this one as quickly as you, as you can. Again, the right back, the whole defence really going to be setting you back um, at least uh, 2k per each player. And again, with the midfielders, the wing is going to set you back a lot. And this team probably maybe looking at 20 or 25k um, and not a great pack either. We looked at Nice and again, all, pretty much all gold team. Uh, so you're not going to have any issues at all to completing this. 10k and you'll get a half decent pack as well. So not too bad. Um, I want to add as well actually that none of these teams require position change or loyalty. So you're absolutely fine. Um, 
if you're just taking these players off the market. Next, we move on to Olympique Lyonnais and uh, basically full goal team, a little bit more expensive purely because of Cornet, uh, Depay, etc. Um, but for the majority, fairly cheap and um, yeah, 18k pro probably could get it for a little bit cheaper than that. Uh, the next team we have PSG. Now it's going to be the most expensive team in um, in the league SBC purely because of the rating. It's an 81. Not too bad um, defense-wise. Kozawa is probably going to set you back the most along with Bernat. Ariola obviously because Buffon's the next uh, available goalkeeper. Um, but as a whole, I mean, it, it's what you expect for PSG. And you get a prime mix players pack. Uh, prime gold players pack, sorry. Which is a 45k pack. And um, for this car, you're probably going to get around maybe 5 to 8k. So, yeah, it's going to cost you around 20k uh, after packs for this one. And on to the remaining six SBCs, we have Marseille and mainly gold team. So, you're not going to have any issues um, to get this one. Uh, Gustavo, probably uh, um, Ocampos, probably being the more expensive ones in the team. Next, we have Strasbourg. Now, this one is going to be fairly expensive because of the. Not only are they silvers, but they're rare silvers, so they're even more in demand and even lower um, in supply. 7k for that left mid, along with 2k for the centre mid, the centre back, and the left back setting you a bit more as well. So be careful about this left side for Strasbourg. Next, we have uh, Kayan, um, I believe that's how you pronounce it, and again, it's kind of half gold, half silver. Be careful of the wings, especially this left winger at C4K. Um, and onto the left back, probably up to around 1.5K by now. So this team might be a little more than 11K, maybe looking at 14 or 15,000 coins to complete this one. And um, we move to Stanley, uh, Stanley Reims. And again, it's going to be not uh, the cheapest one to complete, purely because of the amount of silver is the right mid. Um, and certainly the right back will set you back um, quite a few thousand coins. On to the remaining two teams, Stade Renace, not too bad at all. F um, eight gold, uh, so it's not going to be too bad to complete. And a few silvers. Striker looks like to be the most expensive one in this, and the right back might set you back a little bit. You want to get these on the sniper a bit, fingers crossed. And on to the remaining team, guys, you have Toulouse. Common, uh, common team, definitely, to set you back a few coins in the past. Um, but again, it, it's the silvers that are going to set you back. The goalkeeper, the centre back, the right back and the right mid are going to be the most difficult ones to pick up for cheap so make sure you go and um, try and snipe them and etc so if we head on to the active challenges guys make sure you go on footbin guys if you haven't already and you can see that it says the league and SBC is going to come to around 290,000 coins I would probably expect it probably be a little more higher than that towards maybe 315 to 325,000 coins so 325k we're going to look at the packs now um, and assuming the discard value is about the same around 3k um, there's around 24 teams so you're looking at around 75k discard you're likely to pack someone possibly so let's just say you're going to get 100k back from these packs that you have received 315k 100k you're probably looking at just over 200k to complete this league and SBC total but it's definitely going to take a lot of patience guys if you want to complete this for a good um good price but definitely for the players with obviously the pie and the talvin um, very good players so um, if you want to spend 200k after packs then go ahead and do so but that is it guys for the total cost of the SBCs. hope you have enjoyed um, and um, yeah thank you so much for watching uh, make sure you like and subscribe guys for more types of these videos and we'll have a lot more coming out for the ultimate scream SBCs in the coming days thanks so much and i'll see you next time bye bye